Well, hello, 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 everyone out there in Terror Land. This is your girl Zingaya, the Zen Libran, and welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel, Narcissistic Abuse Tarot. What's up, y'all? What up, though? How y'all doing out there? Y'all doing good? I hope so. I hope so. I hope y'all doing the best you possibly can, and if you're not, you're headed that way. Yeah, I love y'all, and I want to thank y'all for joining me today. Thank y'all for viewing me. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Thank you guys for growing the channel. I really appreciate it, guys. And if you like my vibe, please um, hit the join button and become a Shiro, become an Ark Slayer. All right, guys. All right. Well, of course, this is the Goddess Channel. Um, my channel is all about um, elevating the feminine to her emperor status, getting her back on the throne, you know, so she can rule the way that she was designed to rule, you know. Um, narcissistic abuse is, man, is something, you know what I'm saying? I mean, um, these people that do this, they have a, a disorder. It's called narcissistic personality disorder. Okay, it is a disorder, and these people need help, you know. Going through trials and tribulations with a narcissist is the worst thing a woman could go through. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm speaking from experience, you know. That's why I created this platform, um, to give some understanding to MPD, to uh, get some validation to the victims, because narcissists pretend like they don't do anything, but... Um, we're here to get you validated because we know what these bastards be doing behind the scene. You know what I'm saying? I mean, uh, we're, we're snatching off their mask. Um, they're revealing themselves and everybody is seeing them for the asshole and the jerks and um, just the evil, demonic, possessed people that they are. You know what I'm saying? I mean, very traumatized people, damaged, you know, and damaged people try to damage other people. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's sad. You know, um, but ladies, in order to conquer a narcissist, you have to do something that's so simple, but it's so hard to a lot of people is to love yourself. If you really, truly and genuinely love yourself, you cannot and will not be a victim of a narcissist. See, narcissists are cowards. They prey on the weak. They prey on the wounded. They prey on the broken woman. Or a man, you know what I'm saying? They prey on a broken individual. They're predators, you know? Um, so if you love yourself and you gain your confidence and your courage and you be self-reliant, um, you won't even be bothered with a narcissist. I mean, your vibration will be so high, nothing that a narcissist do will work on you, and you won't give them a time of day, you know? So you have to heal yourself, ladies, you know what I'm saying? And we Nork Slayers, we over here knocking them out. We knocking one out every two seconds. And we're not doing it with violence, y'all. We're doing it with love. So let's generate this love towards yourself. The love that you've been giving this bastard, put it into yourself. So you can propel yourself and elevate and go up higher and away from this narcissist. Because he's always going to be where he is and that's down in the dumps in the trash. So it's time to get out the trash with the narcissist, ladies. Let's heal. Okay? All right. Well, today I'm here to do a general collective reading for the zodiac sign of Pisces. My Pisces. And what is going on out here for my Pisces? Pisces, somebody want to apologize to you. Somebody wants to apologize to you. Somebody wants y'all to be okay. You know what I'm saying? They, they kind of upset that y'all don't have the relationship y'all used to have, that y'all friendship is over. You know what I'm saying? Um, this person wants to be in harmony with you. You know what I'm saying? They want y'all to have a stable relationship. And this person wants you to accept his apology. Yeah. Somebody wants to apologize. All right. That's what's going on with Pisces. Or well, Pisces, this is you want to apologize. You have to put it where it resonates, guys. Okay? Um, and, of course, this is the Goddess Channel. I pull from the feminine energy, and I speak from the goddess's aspect. And the energy that I pull to help me um, bring in this reading for my Pisces is Allah. Allah is here giving us the energy of grief. Yeah, this masculine, he's in grief because this person chose uh, a third party, somebody else over you. 
and the person that they chose over you, they don't trust anymore. This person has become their enemy. Mm -hmm. This person has become their enemy. Um, this is somebody that they flirted with, that flirted with them. You know what I'm saying? It's supposed to just been a fling, but this person took it to a next level with this particular person. For what reason, I do not know, you know? And now this person feels confined, he feels trapped. You know, or maybe even be getting ready to go to jail dealing with this particular person. All right? But he's in grief. You know what I'm saying? Psh, this is Allah giving us the energy of grief. I'm telling you, 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 choices you make. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Bad habits don't judge me. You know what I'm saying? Just don't waste my time, good loving. You know what I'm saying? It's just bad habits, bad choices. You know what I'm saying? Bad choices, you know. Um, bad choices. Bad, bad choices this, this person has made, you know. Um, we have someone here that has been in discomfort. Somebody has been living in discomfort. They got discomfort in their home. You know what I'm saying? I mean, they're not no harmony. You know what I'm saying? I mean, they can't manifest anything. They're emotionally unstable, you know. Um, but um, now somebody is b believing in themselves and they're caring for themselves and they're being concerned for themselves. And um, they're being independent now. You know what I'm saying? They're getting their power back. They're getting their strength back. And this person is triumphed, okay? This person has triumphed by loving themselves. That's what I'm talking about. That's what you have to do, ladies. You know, men too. You got to love yourself to get yourself out of a lot of binds. You know what I'm saying? If you loved yourself in the beginning, you wouldn't even got in this, um, in this mess. You know what I'm saying? I mean, that's real, you know? Yeah. This person wants to shift your perception of how you see them. You know, um, this person over here is depressed you know, uh, could be paranoid because people are gossiping and talking about this person. You know, a lot of rumors came out and they're talking about this person. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And this person wants to shift your perception on how you see them. But you see them exactly as how they are, a damn fool. Yeah, this person was a fool. This person was a fool, you know, um, at what he did to you. You know what I'm saying? This person was a fool and everybody's talking about him. Everybody's talking about this particular person. Um, this person um, took a bribe. Somebody bribed this person. Somebody gave this person some money to attack you. Okay? And he was doing this behind your back because you didn't know. You didn't know. But you're going to get justice for this. You know what I'm saying? This could be some religious group that has been doing this. You're going to get justice from these religious people. They were trying to take you out of here. And they bribed this masculine to do it. So he was their hit man. Yeah. Yeah, he took money to do this to you, sweetheart. And you didn't know it. you just all about your business. You're not paying no attention to him. And all the while, these religious people, I just heard Ephi religion. I just heard Ephi, LDS. Mm-hmm. Yep, this is what I just heard. Um, they bribed this man. They paid this man to come harm you. But you're going to get justice. You're going to get justice from these religious people. Now, these people in the church, y'all, these people in the church, you know what I'm saying, supposed to be leaders of the flock. And look what they're doing. they sending hit me in the people. You know what I'm saying? they bribing, paying people money to go um, end somebody, unalive somebody, distract somebody. You know what I'm saying? These people in the church. These people in the church now, these are supposed to be people of God. It's these people in this Ephi religion. Hmm. Do y'all research on these people? Mm -hmm. They after the youth. They after the youth. And you must be um, influencing the youth, and they don't want you to do that. They don't want you to do that. Yeah, honey. Yeah, honey. These people came up against you. These E5 people, these LDS people, mm -hmm. you're going to get justice. You're going to get justice from this religious group, okay? You defended yourself. 
you was prepared and you was prepared to fight to the death. You have strong willpower. You're very resilient. And you was guarded. You guarded yourself and you kept your boundaries up. And you had an attitude that you would rather die than to submit to these people, to this e religion, for these LDS. LDS stands for uh, Latter-day Saints. Jesus Christ of the Latter-day Saints. That's the church we're talking about here. Yes. Yes. This feminine fought tooth and nail. She fought this hit man they sent over there. And she fought these spiritual battles. She fought these attacks, this spell work. I mean, this is the church. And this is what they're doing. Wicked. Wicked, 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 wicked. Do your research on this E5 people, on this LDS. Do your research. Because they after our youth. They after our youth. Okay? But they couldn't fade you, honey. They couldn't fade you. You would rather die than to submit to them. And I don't blame you, boo. I don't blame you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're so beautiful. You're so beautiful. You're royalty. You, you, you're you a person that's spiritual. And these are religious people. That's why they hate you. Because you're not following their doctrine. You know? And then I got flies around here all of a sudden. I got monitoring spirits. Yeah, I'm talking about y'all ass. You know what I'm saying? So you can fly all around all you want to. This feminine is very beautiful. She's royalty. You know what I'm saying? But one thing this feminine does not do, she does not use her looks, you know what I'm saying, to bring people down because she knows um, that people do this, and this is something that she does not do. You know what I'm saying? But she will protect herself because she is beautiful. A lot of people uh, assume that she doesn't have a brain or they assume that they could take advantage of her because of her looks, you know what I'm saying? So she has thorns, you best believe. You know what I'm saying? She protects herself. She's a Madonna of Roses, okay? And these people, these religious people, and this Ephi religion, they were trying, they were throwing curses and hexes toward her. You know what I'm saying? They was planning or organizing things to, to keep her from taking off because this is a time for her to fly and take off in the world, and they don't want her to. They didn't want her to because as far as they're concerned, she messing up their money because she's uh, influencing the youth out here, and this is what they want to. This is what they want to do. They want the youth to be raised up under their doctrine so they can raise their children under their doctrine, but no. So this is why this, this religious group, uh, these E5 people are attacking her. It's ridiculous, y'all. It's ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? You know, this is her divine time to take off in the world. You know what I'm saying? For her to be seen, and they don't want that. They don't want that. They tried to end her, y'all. They tried to end her. This could be a woman of my persuasion, you know what I'm saying, of my race. And these people are of a different race. Of course they are. They LDS. These could be white people. You know, they come under the, guy, under the guise, oh, bless you, sister, I love you. And they so full of it, these the most wicked, demon, demonic people walking the face of this earth. The most wicked, demonic people walking the face of this earth. Mm-hmm. They want it to you to, they want, to, they want this feminine to be a failure. They want to end her. They want her to be a failure. They want her to be a memory so nobody will remember her. They want her to just be a memory. Something has happened, nothing important. Yeah, they want to take her out of there. You could have locks in your hair, like me. Look at them. Taking a pulse and, you know, all around her. Look at these people. Demons. Demons. You know what I'm saying? Demons. Now here he come. Here he come with his washed up ass. This uh, religious people done used him to try to take this feminine out, but it didn't work. You know what I'm saying? This feminine persevered over everything. She stayed calm through all the spell work that these religious people was putting on her. She stayed calm through it all. She meditated. You know what I'm saying? She got inner peace. She's not worried about these people. And she persevered everything that they, they brought her away. And here he come. I want to be in a relationship. I want to show you I love you. She don't want you, dude. You tried to take her life. And you took some money. You put a price tag on her life. 
Skip to dip your ugly ass up the street somewhere. She don't want you. She don't want you, dog. For real. All right, y'all. Let's see what the universe has to say about, you know what I'm saying? See what we go through, Divine Feminine? We over here minding our own business. You know what I'm saying? And people are attacking us because of our beliefs. We're not att uh, attacking these e people for their beliefs. We don't care what they believe. Why do they care what we believe? Because they know we believe in the truth and they don't want us to spread the truth. We don't give a damn about them. We're not trying to stop them spreading no type of word or nothing. And we just wish that they would give us the, own, the same consideration and leave us alone. But no. No. Because they're wicked. You know what I'm saying? And they got to stop the light. They have to stop the light. That's what they make a told them to do. That's their job. That's their total existence is to put out the light. Wicked, wicked, wicked people. Wicked, wicked Caucasian people. Wicked. Wicked. Hi. God bless you. Yeah, whatever, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. Sad, man. Sad. Yeah. But that's okay. These people, these white people, they ain't going to have no choice but to surrender. To surrender to this goddess. Because regardless of what they're talking about, about she's going to progress forward in life quickly. Because you know why? The divine says so. Okay. She's tired. You know what I'm saying? But she's been sitting having divine patience. You know what I'm saying? And you people, you're not getting no justice. None. None. These people are snakes. This person that they sent to you was a snake. And you shed that skin of that snake a long time ago. Yeah, they've got somebody from your past and bribed this person to get back in your energy. You know what I'm saying? This person thought he was going to open the door to spirit. He thought he was going to get you, baby. He thought he was going to get you. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> mm -hmm. But, you know, Mother Earth has your back. She know that you're going through a troubling time. She know that you've been going through turmoil with these people. And she want to let you know that she ain't forgot you. She working out things behind the scene for you. You know what I'm saying? And everything is going to turn out in your favor. She ain't forgot you, boo. So just keep doing what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? Going after your passions because you're doing a hell of a job. And Mother Earth, you will have justice. You will have justice from this, these people. <sighs> Tell you, boy. Mm -hmm. Tell you. Sad, man. This is the religious people against the spiritual people. And they done sent this fool in from your past. And uh, he took the bribe to try to take your life. Mm-hmm. Stupid. And y'all are the same race. He went against somebody. Um, he uh, discouraged. He, he, you know, he disgraced his race. You know what I'm saying? I hate people like that. Y'all need to, you know what I'm saying? Go on, on over there with these people of other races, man. Since y'all think they better, go on. Because we don't want you anyway because you hate yourself. You hate yourself so much that uh, you would take out a woman, a creator, that brings in your population. You would take her out of here under the guise of people of another race. This person is crazy. This person is crazy. <laughs> Girl, I see 10, 10, 10 out here. Girl, you got some money coming in. I'm thinking, look at all this money out here. Look at all this money out here. Look at all these major connors. Girl, you know what I'm saying? And look, you rejecting these people. You rejected this person. This person, people, they begging. You know what I'm saying? They broke over there. You know what I'm saying? And you, please. You don't want nothing to do with these people. Nothing. Nothing. All right, what we got going on out here? What's going on out here? You got somebody from your past that wants to rekindle a relationship. Okay. But uh, with you, you know, you being the empress. But this person has a family um, with his baby mom. They probably have two kids. You know what I'm saying? Um, and she's cold-hearted. She don't give this person no love or nothing. You know what I'm saying? This is what's happening in his life. 
that he's in a relationship with somebody that's uncaring, unloving, cold-blooded. Uh, she's not a good mother. You know what I'm saying? I mean, she just mentally unstable. You know what I'm saying? And um, this masculine is this is the person that he's with. This is the person that he's with. And you're being cold to him. You know what I'm saying? Um, you don't want nothing to do with him. You're being cold to him. And um, that's stressing him. You know what I'm saying? That he can't get next to you. Because he's in a family with this cold-blooded, uncurring, unfeeling, no soul-having woman. No love at all. And she's stressing him out. She's stressing him out. That's why he want to work with you. He want to work with you. You know what I'm saying? He see you out here making money, doing good, and he want to work with you. You know, because a tower had happened in this person's life. You know what I'm saying? I mean, look who he, what he's dealing with. You know what I'm saying? A demonic person. And this is stressing this person out. I mean, he's loaded up on bills and everything. I mean, he's in the five of pentacles. He's doing really bad financially. And you are the ten of pentacles. Okay. You know, um, this person is praying that he can be in this connection with you. But you know what I'm saying? You blocking this person. You blocking this from you blocked him out of your energy. Mm -hmm. You blocked him out of your energy. Um, this person wants to rekindle a relationship with you. But you know what I'm saying? You don't want nothing to do with this particular person. You don't want nothing to do with this particular person. And this masculine, he wants things to go his way. He wants things to progress um, for as y'all connection is. You and this, this empress, for as him and his empress is concerned, he wants this connection to progress. You know, he wants things to go his way. He wants to be in your life, Divine Feminine, because in his life there is a tower. Okay? He wants a family with you, Divine Feminine. This person wants a family with you. He wants a piece of this Wheel of Fortune. He wants some of this Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But he done took a bribe from these religious people. You know? So to, 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 to take your life, to unalive you, to stop you from making you fail from whatever it is that you're doing. But now he wants to be with you. This person is crazy, y'all. This person is really, 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 really crazy. Okay? This person is crazy. Let's get some energy down here. Because this person is crazy. You rejected this person. You don't want nothing to do with him. You don't give a damn about him not having no money, his finances. You don't give a damn. He ain't got, you ain't got nothing to do. You done lived in discomfort uh, from this person. You know what I'm saying? Doing all type stuff, you know what I'm saying? Because this religious group that sent him to do it gave him some, you know, this E5 religion, the Church of Jesus Christ and Latter Day Saints. You know, they didn't pay this person some money to come and just sabotage you, unalive you. They would have loved that. They hate your beauty. They hate everything. See, they thought you were so pretty and beautiful and pure that you weren't going to protect yourself. But, like I say, a rose has thorns. You best believe. A rose has thorns. Demons, man. These demons. A church full of currents. A church full of currents. This is what she's dealing with. And y'all know what currents are. Yeah. And this fool took a bribe from some currents to bring this feminine down. And now he got the nerve to want to be in a relationship with her. He want to apologize. He wants y'all to be okay. He wants you to accept his apology. Boy, accept these nuts. You know what I'm saying? Accept these nuts. How dare you? You took a bribe to end her, man. Now, this person is, is calling sanctuary. You know what I'm saying? He wants peace. These people up here um, sending magic towards your home. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's crazy. But you're going to have peace from this. That's the church people, y'all. This is people running in the church. This is people that uh, run in a congregation. This is the people that y'all paying tithes to. You know what I'm saying? They're taking your money and they doing spell work on people that ain't did nothing to them. They're taking your money and they hiring hit men to take women out that ain't did nothing to them. Gifted women. 
that's chosen by the divine and it has did nothing to him. These are church people. Mm-hmm. You ain't bothering nobody. You're not telling them nothing about their doctrine or nothing. You're not trying to change what they, you know what I'm saying? You just ask for, them, ask for the same consideration. You know? Yeah, honey. Get centered, though. Get centered. You know what I'm saying? I mean, life is always changing. You know what I'm saying? And um, now you're going to have some beautiful things happening in your life because you're going through impermanence. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you went through the storm, and now it's time to be perm permanent now. It's time for you to grow. It's time for you to be in the sun. So get centered and enjoy yourself, sweetheart, because you've been living in discomfort too long because of this uh, religious organization and this masculine that they sent towards you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They, they want you to join the church, but you're rejecting them. You don't want no part of them. See, if you join their church, that'll bring energy to their church. You don't want nothing to do with these people. Nothing to do with these people. They doctrine or nothing. You are not religious. You are spiritual. You are free. And you in your power. You all powerful. You all powerful. And you trusting in the divine. You know you got all these sharks swimming around you. You trust that everything will be okay in the end. Because you know it. You know it in your gut. You know what I'm saying? You, 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 you trust in your power, and your power comes from the divine, and you trust in the divine. Yeah. And these people can go suck one, for real. A church full of currents, y'all. This is what this feminine is dealing with. Hmm. Yeah. They probably want to come and be generous to you, probably donate to you or something. You know what I'm saying? But it's okay. You know what I'm saying? Um, this experience has given you a lot of personal growth. And uh, you know these people are protesting you and cursing and mad. But that's okay. You know what I'm saying? That's okay. You're not taking it personally. You, you know that these people are sick and ill and retarded and something wrong with them. So you know. They got, they got a lot going in their life. So what they got going on in their life ain't got nothing to do with you. They going through karma. So let them talking. All that talking. Do that while you walking. Best believe that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's ups and downs in life. And this was a downtime uh, learning from this uh, from these people. And now it's time for you to be up. And these people are going to look at your life and wonder, wow, wow, man. And you let all their ass go. You let all their ass go. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And you're doing something in communication or something. And it's popping. And you deserve it. You deserve this. Whatever's happening for you, you deserve this. You know what I'm saying? You could be on the Internet, have a platform. I mean, you're worthy of this. This is divine timing for you. You know what I'm saying? And these people over here, they doing magic on your platform. You know what I'm saying? Because they some some haters. But that's okay. Your ancestors are handling There's no need for you to do anything. Okay? You know what I'm saying? You're very strong and courageous. And you persevered through all this. And the divine is proud of you. That's why you're getting all your manifestations. And um, you're going to be in Joyville. You're going to be in Joyville. You got your confidence. You know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> and you waiting on this bastard to come. You waiting on this per this person to come. You know what I'm saying? You genuine. You've been authentic. Your confidence. You know what I'm saying? You waiting on this snake to come. You know he gonna come around trying to apologize, try to give you a gift or something. You know what I'm saying? But you know a snake when you see one. You shed the skin of this person a long time ago, and you don't want nothing to do with this person. This person just wants your energy. This person wants your vitality because uh, his is very nasty right now. You know what I'm saying? Um, this person may want to take you out on a date or something. You know what I'm saying? But you don't want to go out on a date or nothing with him. You're enjoying your life. You know what I'm saying? Um, and you popping. You looking good. And this person just on the sidelines hating. Just hating. You know what I'm saying? Hating that he could have had an ideal partnership with you. You know what I'm saying? But he wanted, he, he wanted to take things the easy way. He didn't want to be patient. And he took a bribe to take you out of there. You know what I'm saying? I tell you, boy, we go through it, don't we, Divine Feminine? We go through it. I tell them, y'all don't know our life, honey. That's why every day I get gratitude to the Divine. 
every day. You know what I'm saying? Because he done got you out of a lot. Got you out of a lot. And we'll continue. You know what I'm saying? And this is headed your way. This is headed your way if you don't already have it. And this masculine knows it. That's why he wants to be in a connection with you. But we don't want him, do we, all? No. <laughs> well, this is what I have for my Pisces, guys. If you feel anybody could benefit from this reading, please send it to them, guys. And ladies, protect yourself. I mean, it's just crazy out here. I mean, we just can't slack on our protection game because people we don't even know are always throwing stuff at us because we're chosen. People are watching us. We don't even know these people, you know. Like, I'm pretty sure you don't know anybody from the Church of Latter-day Saints. You don't know nobody from no E5 religion. But they casting spells on you and doing hexes and curses on you. It's a dirty world we live in, y'all. And we got to stay protected, okay? All right. I love you, ladies. And as I always end it, please, know thyself, know thyself, know thyself. I'll see you guys on my next reading. And ladies, please stay protected. I love you guys. Bye-bye.